Hi, Mick. Uh, we just heard the big news. Um, maybe short introduction of yourself, and then what is the big news? So I'm Mick Kirsten. I'm the CEO of Tastop Technologies, and I've been closely involved with uh, Eclipse, both as the lead of the Milan project and on the Eclipse board of directors. And today, Oracle announced a very interesting move to take Hudson and move its code and intellectual property onto Eclipse.org. So this is uh, quite an interesting change in this Hudson-Jenkins split that's occurred because Eclipse is a tried and true place where open source projects can meet the needs of their community and of multiple vendors and evolve to be you know, enterprise scale and enter enterprise ready. So that's, that's today's big news, I think. So uh, you blogged about it just an hour ago. Um, why, what is the role of TASO and what is your role in this whole thing? Well, in terms of the big picture, at TASTOP, we're concerned with streamlining the application lifecycle management stack and automating ALM. So continuous integration, I think we've learned over the last, you know, basically the last year or so, it, it's a key part of that stack. It's where all of the build automation happens. Hudson has become very successful through its ecosystem of plugins at basically running and automating things related to the build. So that's, say, the Maven build, it's the coverage test, and so on. And we want to make sure that, that the developer has a seamless experience with that. So we already built a bunch of tooling to bring that into the IDE uh, through Mylan itself. We need, basically want these solutions to co-evolve. So some of the automation that we've layered on, that we're laying on around Git, around the SCM tools, around commercial ALM tools. We want to make sure that works with Hudson by evolving the web service APIs. We want to make sure that efforts that extend Hudson to other parts of the application lifecycle, such as deployment, as we see in Code to Cloud, which automates some of the Hudson deployment um, into cloud PaaS destinations, we want to make sure that we're building on a basically robust set of web service APIs. And while our involvement with the project is not as direct, I've just stepped up as a mentor. TaskTop is going to contribute a committee to this project to help evolve those web service APIs, the ones that we're depending on in the Mylan ALM interoperability framework. So this is, no, this is just a proposal. It's still a gathering community, um, and it's still going to have a, a, a dialogue and, and it's going to get evolved, but you know, I think the key thing is that Eclipse is a good place for these kinds of components to evolve with each other to be versioned properly and to support a robust and large ecosystem of, of plugins and additions. So. Cool. Uh, regarding time schedule, what do you think is the next, what will happen to the proposal? I think right now the interesting thing is that it, this is, it's going to get a lot of eyeballs on it because again it's a big and interesting move by Oracle um, and the community is now going to respond. I'm sure there'll be lots of discussion, and yeah, I'm just very interested in, in, in watching that discussion and seeing where this evolves, because again, I think the relevance of this sort of solidifies how important continuous integration is in the modern ALM stack, and the need to, for, that, for there to be more interoperability, and the relevance of Hudson um, and this technology as a, key, as, as a key component of that stack. So have you already talked to Kozuka Kawaguchi about I it? I did. I was just on a panel with him. Uh, I spoke with him about it. I've been talking, you know, because I've, I became very interested in CI and the way, the way that fits into ALM and the way it fits into the developer experience. Um, I've been having an ongoing conversation with him. And, yeah, I think, you know, Kozuka is still, because this whole move sort of came from the Oracle side, it's all still being interpreted and, and uh, I think we'll see a response, but I think you know the the good thing that we talked about on the panel is that Eclipse is this great place to version software, that it is this vendor neutral ecosystem, and that has very solid governance. And those are, however, this works out. I think those that makes this a, basically a positive move in terms of the evolution of the technology. So, great, really exciting, and thanks for the interview. Thank you very much.